to my channel. Super happy that you guys are here. Today's video is going to be a updated what's in my purse. I get this constantly, constantly, like, hey, do an updated what's in my purse. And I was like, I love doing it. I really love enjoy I really enjoy doing what's in my purse videos. I love watching what's in my purse videos. Um, I think I progress and I think I've been a little bit more on the cautious side of what I put inside my purse now. I guess you grow up and you learn what goes in your purse and what doesn't go in your purse. So if this is your type of video and you want to see what I have on my purse before we go, don't forget to hit subscribe to my channel. Um you can do it after you watch this video. If you're watching me for the first time, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, then you can do it at the end, maybe after my video, maybe you can fall in love with me and say, okay, I'll subscribe to Francis. <laughs> but if you haven't and you wanna be part of my girlfriend squad here on YouTube, all you have to do is hit that subscribe button right down there. And all my social medias are gonna be up here or down below wherever you guys already know the drill. So if you guys want to see what's in my purse updated, what's in my purse, all you have to do is keep on watching. All right guys, so I'm happy that you are still with me. I still have your attention. Ah, I still have your attention. So I got um, a couple of purses for Christmas because I'm obsessed with purses. I don't own a high-end purse. All my purses are from um, what you call a Ross or TJ Maxx. I don't like spending lots of money on my purses. I don't feel like I am in that level yet. I feel like I have kids and I have bills and I have responsibilities. And I feel like I'm not in that level where I can splurge in a very, very expensive purse and not feel bad about it. <laughs> I mean, that's just me. If you can and you can ball like that, then A, by all means, go ahead. Um, I do have a goal of one purse that I want to have when I feel like it's the right time with my channel where I'm there and I can be like, listen, I worked hard for it. Congratulations, Francis. That is like, like, it's in my vision board. <laughs> Just so you know. So today's video, um, I, so I got a, so my dad gave me a Calvin, Calvin Klein purse for Christmas which it was beautiful, but it wasn't my type. I feel like Calvin Klein is more for like, for like my mom or something. <laughs> I mean, if you have a Calvin Klein purse, I'm not, I'm not throwing shade at you or I'm not being hateful or anything, <laughs> but it wasn't me. So then I was like, dad, I want to change the purse. So he's like, all right, let's go. So we went to, um, we went back to Maisie's and I was looking around, I was looking around and I saw a Michael Kors one and I was like, well, um, it is what it is, it's cute, it's what I'm looking for, it's the color that I'm looking for, so I'll buy it. So I bought it and when I got home, I started using it for like two days and I was like, mm, this isn't me, this is not who I am. So I decided to go back to Macy's and I returned the purse. I'm glad my dad doesn't watch this video so he doesn't speak English. So I decided to return the purse and um, I took the money and I ended up at Marshall's. <laughs> I'm telling you, like I I can't knowing that I'm, I have spent so much money, but I said, listen, it's a gift. I want to get a high-end purse. I want to get a nice purse. That is where my new baby comes into my frag life. Ah, I'm so happy. This is a purse I got. It's a Kate Spade purse. It's a satchel. It's a, um, a crossbody or whatever. It's a bag. Um, I am obsessed with this bag, guys. I really have to do the story because I want you guys to know how she came about in my life. My best friend is a Henry Bendel girl. She is Henry Bendel, Henry, 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 Henry. She has all types of Henry purses and I'm like, you know what? That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna change it for Henry. And I went and I'm the type of person that if I go and I'm gonna buy a purse, I don't like to order it and wait for it to arrive. I like to leave the store with the freaking purse. Anybody feel the same way? So whatever, when I saw this at Marshall's, I was like, yes, you're mine. And I'm super happy. I texted her and I said, listen, I'm sorry, I didn't buy Henry Bendel. I feel like I'm your rival. I have a Kate Spade and you have Henry Bendel. I feel like they're rivals. So she was like, it's okay, I still love you. So I have to say I'm obsessed with my purse. It's black all around. It has the Kate Spade um, logo in the front. 
Um, it has a little tassel in the front, and it, you open it up, and it has a um, it has a um, it has a pocket in the front, and then you can use it carrying it like this, or you can use it carrying it like this on your shoulder and that's what I like about the purses that I can use it either or and then it's quite spacious in the inside it has a little clip so it kind of clips already and it's quite spacious it's not a heavy purse I feel like it's a you can use it in every day and you can also use it to look glamorous or whatnot so let's go ahead and see what I have inside my purse. I know that I've talked a little bit I can see it but I wanted to give you guys an information about what's in my purse. All right, so lately I've been into being very organized. I said 2018 was gonna be an organized year where I keep myself very organized with everything. So that's what I've done. So the first thing I'm gonna pull out is I always have my Desi Perkins and Key Australia glasses. These are by far my favorite sunglasses. I also have the rose gold, so either whatever I'm wearing. Um, normally, you guys see me, I always wear the, my army green. I'm always in that green color because I'm always rocking uh, my green Adidas. <laughs> All right, the next thing, of course, is my phone. Um, I also got a Apple Watch for Christmas, so now I just throw my phone in there and I'm happy that I don't have to be like, oh my God, where's my phone? But the coolest part about having having an Apple watch and you can throw your phone in your purse is that oh my god where's my phone your Apple watch sends a freaking signal to the phone and I'm like yes, yes thank you Jesus my life has been made because I always lose my phone I don't know where I throw it inside my purse then after that we have I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the small bag for last because it has the most things um when you have kids and they decide to use the toilet outside because we leave the house and that's when they're like, Mommy, they're going to start buying the little pee pee. And you're like, we were just in the house. Um, you do have to have Clorox wipes when you have kids. So Clorox wipes is in there. Of course, my um, hand sanitizer, I always keep it. You have kids. My son is highly allergic to um, dairy, milk. Um, my little one's allergic to everything you can possibly think of. So we sometimes are out eating stuff. So we, I always have to keep a hand sanitizing bottle with me in my purse because I was like, oh, um, I don't really know what's this in here. Oh, I know what this is for. This is to tie my children when I go outside. Like I tie you and I tie you to my wrist. I'm just kidding. <laughs> this is from my camera, from my Fujifilm camera. Um, I don't even know why that was in there, but that's never in there. All right, the next thing is this little thing that I made it into my wallet. I saw my ID hanging around, yeah. Let me just put my ID back in here. I turned this into my wallet, guys, look. This is my wallet. You can't even think that it's a wallet, but it is a wallet. It's supposed to be for your tampons, and it doesn't look like a wallet. So that's my wallet, I know. All right, the next thing, of course, you have to keep is a Uno's gum. You don't want your breath to be kicking like a soccer team and be like, you know, sometimes you like to eat el ajo, the garlic. Um, of course, my glasses. Um, you would say, Francis, keep it in a... My glasses are already all jacked up, like literally all jacked up. Time for new glasses. But these are my glasses. These are, um, these are no brand whatsoever because that's what I do. I don't get brands because I know that I'm always going to mess them up and break them. But they are similar Ray-Bans. They are similar to the Ray-Bans and I'm going to link it down below because a lot of you people ask me on Snapchat, what are my glasses? They are like, they're similar to a, um, a Ray-Ban. I don't know the code at the moment, but I will leave it on the bottom part and you will see um, the actual Ray-Bans. Instead of having blue on the um, here, they're like, I think they're white if I'm not mistaken. Okay, the next thing is, this is supposed to be in here. The next thing I have is this little survival kit. I call it my survival kit. If you guys seen my, uh, what's in my bag, you guys have already seen these bags everywhere. I'm sorry, inside my bag. This is where I keep pretty much, um, quédate aquí. This is where I keep pretty much everything to survive. Meaning, I keep pens, I keep lipsticks, I keep um, hand lotion, I keep uh, scrunchies. I keep um, some tampons in here. I keep some panty liners. I also have some of my business cards with me in here. I have a, I use this one for the mirror because I just think it's so glam and when you take it out, you put it on makeup and you put it in lipstick and you're using this. So I use this mostly for the um, mirror. Then I have the little Tide Mini to go because when you have kids, I'm just kidding, I'm very sloppy. 
I eat and just like, ah, oh, come on. That's me all the time. So I gotta keep one of these in there. Um, when you're hypoglycemic, glycemic, you also have to have a little bit of candy just to make sure that your blood sugar doesn't go like all cuckoo in the head. Of course, we're gonna have more lipstick, lip glosses, pens, um, more lipsticks, more lip glosses. Notice that they're all nude. Yes, baby. And I like to keep my um, beets also in here. So that is what I keep in this little bag. This is like my survival bag. Um, bobby pins I used to keep in there, but you I, you can't keep bobby pins. Bobby pins have the mind of their own. All right, so then the other two things I have in here right now. Um, oh, my other lipstick, it fell. I have another lipstick. The other thing I have in here, guys, is this book that I'm starting to read, and I have to say that I've only read the introduction and chapter one, and I am truly obsessed. I'm super intrigued as to what's on the, um, like, what's further in this book. It's You Are a Badass. How to Stop Doubting Your Greatness and Start Living an Awesome Life. I said that in 2018 I was gonna get into reading books, into um, expanding my knowledge, into doing a lot of self-help books and stuff like that. Um, and the first one I picked up was this one and highly recommend it guys if you're looking into reading books This is amazing. She also Jensen said also came out with you are a badass at making money But that's gonna be my second one after I finish this one So I keep this one here just in case I'm like waiting for my kids at school or I'm at the doctors um, I'm trying to drift away a little bit more from just being stuck on Instagram 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 and like, oh, uh, Zombie I'm trying to stay away from that and kind of like really make a life that is worth living and that I'm happy with. Okay, and then the last thing that I have in here in my purse, everything else is receipt. And then last thing, ah, look I see, clean purse. Well, actually these are the little things that fell. Look at the purse inside. I wanna show you the inside of the purse. It's um, really big, I don't know if you guys can see it. It has a zipper. Right here, you can see the zipper, and then it has like another compartment over here. So, but it's really wide. It's really, I love the fact that it stays like that. It stays. So, the last thing is my baby. I just got this also for Christmas, and I've been talking about it, and I will make a video on this, guys, because you guys wanted to know how to, how I stay organized and how I stay on top of things with YouTube, kids, husband, house, um, and my shop. So this is how I stay on top of things. And this is pretty much a traveler's notebook. And what I have in here are different kind of notebooks and everything to keep my life organized. So this first notebook is my list notebook. I, I don't wanna really get into details because I wanna make a video, but this is just pretty much a, a, the list notebooks, like where I make my list, like things I have to buy, um, like my to-do list, like I had to do groceries, so I put it here, and then I also have somewhere else, I also have my appointments for the month of January. So this is my list notebook, and then the one in the middle is the actual calendar. This is where I write all my doctor's appointment, um, when I have to go to kid's school, because I have a teacher parent conference, when I have to pay my bills and all that, that is goes here on my personal. And then I have the other one, which is the bullet journal. This is pretty much where I keep track of everything, like um, the books I wanna read and all that. It's That's a bullet journal. And then the last one is what is called the actual traveler's notebook. This is where I want to document, I have the sticker notebook also in there. This is where I wanna document um, like my life for 2018, meaning I want to be able to document the awesome things that I do in the year. So at the end of 2018, I can look back into my notebook and just go through every accomplishment, everything I did with my family, the vacations and all that. So everything is in here. So this is like my baby. I have everything in here. When I say everything is everything. And this helps me stay organized and helps me stay on top of things. But I will definitely do a video, a separate video on that, on how I stay organized, how you can set your goals and achieve them for 2019, and how to create a vision board. I don't wanna show you because I, I don't, I don't wanna show you because I wanna have a video for that. A vision war and all that that is coming to my video to my channel pretty soon <laughs> well anyways guys this is all I wanted to share with you guys I really hope you enjoyed the video um I really hope that you liked it and if this is not your type of videos then don't forget to give this video a big old thumbs up así pulgar para arriba 
Dale, dale like al video. <laughs> Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel and you want to be part of my beautiful girlfriend squad here on YouTube, hit that subscribe button. It don't bite, but it will change your life. Thank you guys so much for sticking till the end. Thank you guys so much for your love. Thank you guys so much for always watching my videos, for always interacting with me. I love you guys a lot. I wish I can hug you and kiss you guys. One day I will. One day. Thank you guys so much for sticking to the end. Muchos besos. I'll see you ladies on my following video. Adios.